Hello, good morning. This is Orina Spice. This morning I'm going to make some dal puri mix, which we're going to make some dal puri with that. So here I have one cup of dal. This is a dal mixture. And I'm going to put it here. But before I do that, I already put some water here to boil. I see the water is hot here and it's boiling. So I'm going to wash this, wash this dal a little. It in. So yeah, wash it. Always wash the peas. This is a lentil, so it's uh, you know you also call it dal. So I'm gonna drain it. Okay, so I put it in. Okay, I let it boil about 30 minutes and then you know I'll check it or before that I'll check it to see. You can't over boil it too soft because we're making some roti with this dal puri roti. Okay, as I was boiling the dal, you see the dal got to be soft. So it's not too soft either because you want to grind it. So when you put it like this, you see it's ready. So it's finished. It's about 30 minutes boiling finished. So I'm going to drain it. So then we have to grind it. Okay, so I put my pan on here to heat. This is what you call a jira, or we call it um, mm. cumin. So I'm gonna patch some. This is how I patch it, dry patch. I put it in there, and you're gonna patch until it turns brown. When you finish, then I'll grind it. So, so this is some of the um, seasoning I'll be using for the um, the dal the dal puri peas. Now this is how I would take out the cilantro. I don't use the stem because you know you want it to get a little fine in it. So I'm not gonna use the stem. I'm gonna chop it up. I'm gonna chop it in in this um, thing that I have here. I use garlic, three clove of garlic for that amount of dal and some pepper but you know I like our green chili you don't want to put the chili it's fine because it's kind of a little spicy but I, I, I use it anyway when this you have to chop very thinly because you don't want it when you make the roti you don't want it to peep out and some of this shallot green onion Whatever you call it, but um, all that will have to go in the mix. So I'm gonna um, I'm, I'm roasting the the jira right now, and then we'll we'll show the next step. I'm gonna grind the dal. I finished drain the dal, so I'm gonna grind it. This is a a food grinder, like you know, you can grind stuff inside, especially like this um, lentil peas, this dal. So I'm gonna grind. You have to grind it a little at a time. So I'm gonna, that's about it. I'm gonna grind that. And then um, you can see them start to do it like this and this. Grind it like this. And so this is how we're gonna grind. See inside there, getting very soft. about 10 minutes to grind this dal out or you could use a blender if you don't want to use this you could use a blender, blender is okay so now I grind the dal nice finely grind and I'm ready to put in my ingredient but before I do that I want to show you the jira this is the jira I was patching cumin uh, cumin jira whatever you call it and I um, patch it you see get nice and brown this take about 10 minutes from medium heat to lower heat and then it all uh, you're gonna patch so now it look like it's ready see it's brown there and um, I'm gonna grind some so the jira I already popped the jira and um, I'm gonna grind it if you don't have a mill you could buy the grind already but I like to like the fresh I like to roast it fresh and grind it
Okay, I grind the jeera. Now I'll put two tablespoons of this jeera in this. One. This is two. Ground cumin, right? Yeah, cumin. All right, call it jeera. Now this is my mix. I'm gonna put um, some fresh grated garlic. I'm, I like grated it, so I'm gonna throw it in here. Two is good for a monk for a cup of dal. I'll add a little one more. Also, this is the grind, uh, this is a chop up cilantro. This is uh, the chop onion or shallot or scallion, whatever you call it. And I have some finely chopped green chili. It's, it's spicy a little, you don't need it, you don't, um, you don't put that. Add a little touch of black pepper. This is optional. And then we turn it. We use a tablespoon of salt. Now we blend everything together. Nice blend. Now this is ready to um, fold in the roti and to cook. Hi, so now I'm gonna show you how you fill the, the roti. Okay, I um, in my other video I show how to do the roti dough. So I'm gonna show you now how to fill the a roti with this. First we do, we add some oil in the middle. And you spread it around. Then I add amount of um, in here and then I started doubling it like this this is how it look so now I'm gonna cook it roll it out you could put less dal if um if you don't the mixture because you gotta be careful too because sometimes you can get um, over full it might be hard for you to roll it okay so now I'm gonna put it on the pan to cook Put it on medium fire. Then you turn it. On the fire. The stove got to be a little hot, so it's going up. Then you put some oil on top to cook. Now we put oil on one side, so I'm going to put some oil on the other side. Already finished already. It's optional to put oil. Well, I'll make it really soft and delicious. I mean, you know, really soft. I'll give it a. Um, so this is when you when you put too much of the dal, something would um, you know try to come out. But let go put less dal is good. Let's finish. So this is what we call. A dal lentil roti. This is it. Finish. And um, this is um, this is my delicious dal puri roti. roti, lentil roti, and I'm gonna cut it for you to see how nice the dal look inside. See the dal is all over inside. You could see it. It's very delicious and soft, flaky. Now, um, I would like you to try my roti because it's very, very soft and delicious. And um, the seasoning 
if you if you don't want to use all the seasoning if you don't care to use all the seasoning you could use um, some salt and black pepper not the chili if you don't want the chili but you could use some um, chopped onion and I don't know the jira is good it gives a nice flavor the cumin but this is um this is arena spice I want to say thank you guys for watching try my recipe because it's really really delicious delicious this is my way of making my my dal puri roti okay so I see you guys if you want to know how to make the the dough I already did a, you could check my other video of the roti that I make so this the way I make it and then you know you could use this recipe for putting it all in bye bye now thank you guys have a good day